LibreOffice is a beautiful suite of softwares for documentation, but uh, it has its own set of limitations. For example, in the LibreOffice Calc, when you want to create a table, um, you can't really create it uh, similar to what uh, Excel offers, which uh, essentially lets you create an object and then you can do a lot more things with the table. So we will see a glimpse of that as well. And also we will try to understand the difference between LibreOffice table and the Microsoft Excel table. So here, let's say if you are having a serial number names and then marks, for example, one, two, three, four, five, or one, two, three, four, Ron, Ton, Mon, Con. So for example, very random names and then 10, 20, 30, 40. So now if you want to create a table in, in Excel, then all you have to do is select the cells and then go to insert and then go to table. And here you are able to create the table which would mean it's a uh, Excel's feature to create a table and uh, by default it lets you filter the rows by any certain value or you can filter out you can sort things so you can do a lot more things and then you can easily change the color of the table so it's very easy and then you can also let's say if you want to add a location of that we can do that as well so here as you can see we have added a new column as well and the table feature identified that but when we are talking about our office if we'll try to create similar table so we'll just copy paste so if we're going back to the library office, pasting all the data, it is now it has now pasted that as a image, which is strong. Let's try pasting that as a as text, unformatted text. Will it do it? Yeah, it has done it. So now, as you can see, we are having a few cds as well now library office doesn't have that feature so all you can do is first of all you could see that uh, there was the filter functionality so you can go and select auto filter so the, by that you will have the filter in your table imaginary table you can make it look like a table by adding borders so how do we add borders we go here here you can see we have borders then select the border border outside and border inside so that's how you will get borders you can make it look neat by aligning by aligning everything to the center and there you can just uh, make the header bold and you can have it colored as well so we now we have colored the background of the header so now this is kind of a table not really the excel table which uh, everyone wants but this is something that will allow you to achieve whatever you wanted to for example now if you want to add a new column you can do that um, you just have to start typing it out so for example country so India, France, India, and then USA. So all you have to do is just copy formatting. So select uh, all the rows or cells, and then we'll see this uh, clone formatting. So go here, go there, and formatting would be copied. And then you can just uh, include that as a filter. So by going to data and then auto filter so that ways that will also be included in the 
filter selection. So this is how you create a table in LibreOffice Calc, although it is not similar to Excel, but uh, definitely you can replicate those features by doing some manual work, for example, adding the border, adding the color, and adding the data filter. So primarily, those are the three features of the Excel table, and you can achieve that in LibreOffice by just making uh, it a little manual or doing it manually. So I hope this will help you. Thanks so much for watching this tutorial. If you liked it, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you didn't, then leave a comment so that we can improve it further. Do watch these suggested tutorials to learn even more. And do let us know what you want to learn on being skilled.